Evening, everybody. It's uh, Sunday evening at 7.05, and this is your first look at the futures uh, for tomorrow. Uh, nothing on the grains. They're not open yet. Oil is up 43 cents, just under 70 bucks, 69.69. Uh, heating oil up about two cents. Gasoline up about a third of one cent. And that gas, of course, down eight cents. Uh, the gold is down seven and a half. Uh, silver down about six cents. Copper is up a little, less than half a cent. So not overwhelming. Although I will say that uh, there's a lot of action across all of the metals. Not only copper, gold, and silver, but also things like iron ore, um, tin, nickel. Uh, this is not all that unusual when you get a, a big move across all of the metals. Um, nothing in the cattle, nothing in the softs here uh, tonight yet. Uh, as far as stock futures, the S&P is up about uh, 19 bucks. Let's see, 18.75, up 47 and a half on the Nasdaq, up 132 on the Dow, and last week's big loser, um, the Russell, up 10 and a half. Um, uh, I don't mean to say that the Russell was down last week, but as far as performance on a day by day basis, it was definitely the weak sister on more than one occasion. Uh, the dollar is down a little, Bitcoin up to 10, seven and a half dollars on Ethereum. Most of the currencies are up against the dollar and the bonds are down six. 30 seconds. I haven't seen anything overwhelming news-wise uh, over the weekend or tonight, so I'm just going to let it go right here. And I uh, want to remind everyone, you ought to take a look at the, um, in this week's letter, um, at the uh, Stock Traders Almanac. Uh, April is generally the last month of the best six months of the market. And um, it's also pretty strong generally. Um, we start the second quarter a week from tomorrow. So this week is the last week of the quarter. You will see some evening up uh, of positions, some rebalancing. Um, Clearly, there are going to be plenty of funds who want to show positions in NVIDIA or Netflix and may not want to show positions in uh, some of the retail stocks that have gotten pounded of late. So uh, just be wary. There's going to be plenty of volume, but just be wary not to get sucked in um, expecting something to follow through because it may not. All right, everyone. Hope you had a good weekend. I'll be back in the morning.